Good afternoon. All protocols observed. My name is Maria Mumbi Kirubi. I am the daughter of Dr. Michael Gishohe Kirubi, who was the youngest brother of Christopher Kirubi and the cradle of his heart. The bond that my dad shared with Uncle Chris was a bond that was so unique and so dear. It was a bond we've never seen before. So unique that my dad decided to take his name as Kirubi and we took the last name as Kirubi. That is why we are called Kirubi. I'm here on behalf of my dad to read his tribute. To my brother Chris, you loved me from a tender age and raised me as your own until your last breath. I will love you eternally. When I was in class three, Chris took me in and he raised me as his own. He loved me, he educated me until my PhD level. He gave me all the tools I needed in life. He supported every journey of my life and each milestone. He was the only father figure I ever knew. He held our family together and he took it on his shoulders to take care of his sisters and his brothers. Anytime we came to him for help, advice, be it one thing or another, he was always there. He was always real and honest. Anyone who knows Uncle Chris knows that he said what you needed to hear when you needed to hear it. He'd push you to be the best and he always believed in you. You counseled my children and loved them as if they were your own. You taught them the values of discipline, you equipped them and you helped them, stand, and you helped them understand the importance of education and gave them a role model to always look up to. Even though you are not here with us anymore, your spirit and your legacy is with us and it will live on forever in our hearts. Napoleon said once, when he was boasting about what he had done for France, after it had, after it had, failed, for, after it had failed so many revolutions, remember France, I picked you from the gutter with my sword. And that is what my brother Chris did for me. He picked me from the gutter with his sword, loved me, nurtured me, and made me into the man I am today. When I knew I was coming to speak here on behalf of my dad, I said to him today, Daddy, what will we say? How will we say goodbye to Uncle Chris? And he said, there is nothing else to say but to tell him I love him. And that is what I leave you with. Uncle Chris, we love you. Rest now. 